Hello everyone, it's Matimus. Thank you again for joining me today on this video. I am still a little sick, so I apologize if I sound like something that has been been thrown at me pretty hard at my face because it just all bunged up and I can barely speak properly, so I do apologize. I'm going to try my best to get through this uh, video without uh, too much interruption from my voice. So, uh, we're playing some more Combat Mission Shock Force, and we're continuing on with our Task Force Thunder campaign. And uh, we recently completed our airfield mission. If you haven't checked it out, please feel free to back check in my channel and have a look at those videos. I had to take two attempts because I didn't do too great. Um, but this time we're moving on to our next mission, which is Root Lightning. Uh, enemy forces on this particular mission, uh, we're knowing that uh, there's an Iraqi border coming up, so there's a lot of tanks and obviously a lot of anti-tank weaponry. Uh, our basic mission, I guess, is to plow down through Root Lightning and head towards our next objectives. Um, we do have some recon elements that we're going to start off with, uh, following with that we're going to get some heavy tanks uh, and then also we're going to get some uh, infantry and uh, <coughs> pardon me, and uh, some strikers which will be nice. Uh, terrain and weather where well, it's hot and it's a desert, it's flat and there is very little uh, cover on this mission I guess, it's uh, flanked by some small rolling hills. Our mission is to advance down the road and cross the salt pan reaching the waypoint objective Greece, Greece Lightning. Uh, your job is to advance uh, with the guard and main formation is to spot enemy ambushes. So basically our primary mission at the beginning is to recon for the main body coming through later on. Commander's intent and state is that the advance guard has crossed all the salt pan and arrived at objective Greece. Should enemy resistance be encountered is to be neutralized as possible so as to not slow down the main body. The recon elements are to be kept intact for the continuing operation. So keys, key points here, keep the recon going, get moving as quickly as possible check for enemy targets, make sure the main body can get through. So, pardon me, my sniffs, let's get rolling. Okay, so here we go, and it's nice straight away to see that we've got a Bradley on our side, it's always a nice thing to have. Now we've got some Humvees, so this is obviously our reconnaissance team here, let's have a quick look at the map. So we have a corridor kind of map, just a straight down objective kind of thing going on, that's nice. Uh, main MSR heading down to objective Greece, uh, oh, aerial. Aerial photography shows some uh, nasty little trench systems going on here. That is not good. Left and right of the, uh, the track here, so I'm going to have to be careful with that. Let's head down to Objective Greece. And some more emplacements with trenches and stuff down here too. So I'm presuming my tanks are going to be along this route somewhere too. So my primary intent here is to get the mission going, uh, get it rolling pretty quick, um, and to get the units down there as quickly as possible. It's one of my primary objectives is to keep the main body rolling. Uh, but one of my other primary objectives is making sure that this uh, scout party is, uh, you know, going to make it through because I don't want to lose my reconnaissance team for this uh, main body of the battle group. So if I can get them into a secure location first of all, hide them up a little bit, and then from there see if I can find any targets. Um, we're pretty exposed in this area. Once I get my uh, main body of armor through, I'm just going to get them punching, guys. I'm just going to get them rolling through as quickly as possible because the quicker I can get them down to objective Greece, the better. Um, because I want to try and keep along the theme of the whole campaign of lightning and thunder and task force rolling and blah blah blah. Um, so yeah, let's get that started first. So let's get these units out of the way here. Um, we're going to pull him back. We're going to pull him back too. I'm going to pull him back too. Look at that beautiful Bradley rolling, the M3A3 I think this is, yeah. Here comes the artillery. We're ready. I guess they're not happy we're here, they're giving us a bit of a heads up. <coughs> Pardon me guys, I apologize. Not feeling good lately. 6th Cavalry Fighting Vehicle M3A3 Bradley. Beautiful. Okay, so we're out of the way here, out of some cover. That's just what I want, I don't want these boys exposed too much. Get the Bradley on the far. Artillery is definitely uh, making me a little nervous here. It's quite heavy. Okay, we're going to move them slowly up the hill once they get into position. Let's cancel that wait till we go up as a group. Oh, got some cool itching going on there. Okay, good. So we've got our Bradley on the hard left flank, uh, providing any cover to the left. And we're just going to move them up really slowly here. 
see if we can see anything. So, being on top of this hill is going to expose us really, really nicely um, for the enemy, which is not going to be great. But it's going to be probably one of the only areas that I can get good eyes on the enemy from this area uh, to the south of the objective. So, if I come to the left, I'm exposing myself to those trenches, so I've got to be careful. And also, that artillery is lighting up that road. It's going to be hell for my, uh, the rest of the battle group to come through here. Okay, just taking it nice and slow and steady up the hill. So it looks like these Humvees have some sort of uh, recon cameras on them. Better optics than say just a normal guy. Yeah, he's got some. Oh, I love how the Humvees have the American badges on the wind windscreen like that. It looks cool. Okay, boys, let me see what you can see. Can't see anything. Well, that artillery is getting far too close for comfort. Okay, there's our first target seen. Freaking artillery. Come on, bratters. Move it up. Get out of the way of that left flank. That was a close round there. So we're getting explosions in the distance here. I don't think that's our artillery. I think that what potentially that might be is that uh, those anti-tank teams that we just spotted there trying to actually engage my troops and they're coming, falling short, way too short. I think that's what that is. Christ, they're not messing around with that artillery. Whoa, it's getting close now. There's another missile team. If you can engage it, engage it. Oh, yes! Anti-tank missile. Not sure if he hit it or not, but... Oh, yeah, beautiful. That was just amazing. Putting some rounds down, I like it. Okay, so we have a machine gun team down the bottom here too. Let's try and focus on that first. Switch fire. Well, they're pinned, that's good. Good. Okay, so recon teams are making some good headway here. Got a nice little firing position up here. I'm a little exposed, I'm a little concerned. This Bradley's making a little disco for itself on the top here with some smoke screen. So he's going to have the glow sticks out on top of the turret any minute now. Look at that smoke. A little, a little OTT there, buddy, but that's okay. I didn't even ask you to pop smoke. There was no real requirement for you to pop smoke, but that's fine. Okay, we'll get him to clear target now. Save some ammo. I'll get you to clear target too. Okay, the tanks have arrived and perfectly in time for the lull of the artillery. So as I said before, I want to try and keep this moving as quickly as possible, especially with artillery like this coming in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to split the tank teams into two separate fire teams. Of, uh, so we'll get the tank team moving to the left as fast as we can. And we're going to find a tank team moving to the right as fast as we can. And we'll just engage anything we see en route. So I want to try and engage these trenches first. I've got a good feeling when I get some serious RPG hits here, so I'm going to have to be very careful. There's a... yeah. I can get eyes on those. If you see anything in that area, fucking destroy it. Oh, a little shook up there. Come on then, boys, let's see what we can see.
Okay, nothing so far. Here we go. Shit's about to hit the fan now, boys. Okay, line him up. Give him hell, give him hell. Okay, Abrams have spotted contacts already. Oh, enter tank team. Let's take him out. Take him out now. Just destroy him. Good. Clear target. Move forward. Okay, anti tank teams. Let's go for the anti tank teams first, boys. Put a round right on that son of a bitch. That was a terrible shot, fella. But yeah, that's good. That's what we want. Keep their head spin down. Okay, I'm actually going to bring my Bradley up here. Clear target, move fast, get into this area, provide support. Actually, no, 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 stop. We'll just let the Abrams do the work for now. We got tanks, we got tanks. Clear target, take those tanks out now. Okay, clear target. They can really do some infantry support here. What are we engaging in the distance? Looks like we have tanks, but I'm not sure what kind. Let's have a quick heads up. That's what I want to see. I want to see tank crews running away from their tanks. That vehicle is still operational. Take it out. Whoa, good shot, boys. Okay, Abrams are still in heavy contact here with infantry. I want to try and take out those tanks first, though, so hopefully they're prioritizing the tank targets first. Looks like small arms fire, so I'm not hugely concerned about what's going on with these guys right now. Oh, that tank is still operational. We got more tanks coming in. Oh yeah, they got a lot of tanks coming in now. Come on, take them out. Don't let that tank move. I'd love to call in for more to strike right now in this area. Whoa, crap. Put a round on those fuckers now. Ah, come on. Target it. Target him. Ah, oh, shit. It's immobilized. Okay, clear target. Target that son of a bitch now. Some of my strikers come in? Yes. Here we go. Here come the boys. Let's get them moving in as quickly as possible to support these Abrams. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We use their own trenches against them now. I'm going to move these Abrams up quickly. Okay, let's bring the rest of my troops in. Let's punch it, punch it. He is just out for the count, this guy. He is immobilized to fuck. Artillery. It's landing in some random places though, so it should be okay. I'm going to bring my Bradley up now. So 
when my momentum has slowed down quite a bit with this entrenched system here, but that's okay. Switch target. Take out that anti-tank team. It's pretty pinned. Yeah, that's it, buddy. Keep your head down. You had a 120 mm gun fired at you. I'll let the infantry finish you up, fella. Okay, boys. Punch it forward. Abrams, you can't move. You can, though. So let's get you moving forward fast. Let the infantry finish up this. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, it looks like Objective Grease is giving us some hell right now. Holy crap! Oh shit! Okay, the vehicle's down. Need to assault. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just get in there. Get into that trench system. Let's get my teams in these trenches. Okay, boys, let's go. Keep these boys moving forward as well. Get my command team into the trench as well. Let's go. Can't believe I lost a striker there. That's not good. Okay, let's see if we can get them moving then. So the runes are pretty exposed. Need to clear target and punch it. We're just going to punch it, guys. We're just going to get in there, see if we can take out that position. Okay, let's get you in some nice positions here. Machine gun teams. Holy shit. We got another hit. He's hit bad. Hop smoke. Need those anti attack teams taking out ASAP. Let's get my Bradley up here too. He can't. He's immobilized. What the fuck? Come on, fellas. Come on, engage, engage, engage. Just keep putting rounds into this hillside. Once this strike is in position, it's all hell's going to break loose with this infantry. Okay, he's immobilized too now. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Kill every single one of them. Okay, we 
dog going on here. He's immobilized. He can move up fast though. Let's go up here into the fight. Holy crap. That poor Bradley's getting hammered right now. Nothing I can do about it. I need to take out those forward observers. Where were they? You can't move. You're immobilized. Holy cow. That was intense, guys. That was intense. Whew. Okay, so I lost zero men, which is awesome. Um, I did get one wounded. Uh, I lost zero tanks. I did lose an armored vehicle, but that's okay. Not a massive loss. The rest of the vehicles could be repaired, I guess. So not too bad. It wasn't too bad at all. Uh, the enemy lost 53. 43 went missing. <laughs> uh, and they lost six tanks, which is a good result. Good result. So I'm happy with that, guys. Not too bad at all for a root lightning mission there. Um, we're going to continue on with our next uh, mission on this campaign in the near future here, so please make sure you stay tuned. Um, absolutely loving this game, by the way. I remember it as clear as the day as I played it back in the olden days. Um, yeah, like I said, plenty more to come. I've got my other expansion packs that were kindly donated to me by uh, one of my fellow uh, YouTube followers, so thank you very much, sir. I will be playing those missions once I get through the original Task Force Thunder campaign. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a comment. Uh, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And uh, if you enjoyed it, please slap that thumb like button. And apart from that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you again for watching. Bye-bye.